Okay, well, I just filmed a 20 minute video about how I did this to my hair, and it was really funny because it looked like DJ Polly D before it got to like somewhat um, presentable like it is right now. And I recorded the entire thing without sound. So you didn't hear any of my funny commentary, you didn't hear anything that I said about when I went out to 3M on Saturday morning for the first time in two years and how I'm way too, be old, too old to be going to an EDM show. And you didn't hear about my little baby AJ as a bumblebee for Halloween. And most importantly, you didn't hear all the funny commentary I made because my, this was such a process. So maybe I'll be able to edit it in and you can just like watch it visually and maybe that will be entertaining. Okay, so this is me doing my hair. I didn't come to work today. I didn't do anything to it. I just um, shampoo with spring roll and let it naturally dry. So here I am. It's 2 o'clock. I'm like, I might just make this video. I heat, heated up my flat iron, sprayed my whole head with faux finish, and then I used a section comb to take pieces and basically make big curls, waves with the flat iron. I went all over my head, as you can see. I don't even know what story I'm taught telling, but even I'm interested in it right now based on my facial expressions. I'm sure it was good, and I'm sorry you didn't miss it. But as you see, I'm going through, doing the flat iron, all over the head, talking about nothing, flat iron, curl, spray, brush, flat iron. I got a lot more hair than it looks like, huh? Well, here's where I went wrong. I should have left my bangs down like that and finished with the texture all around and then had the bangs kind of down, but I went all crazy with it and tried to take them back. And uh, we're getting to the end of the flat ironing, I hope. All right, so now I'm going to put pomade in. Rub it together in my hands, and oh my God, look who it is. Wait for it. It's Polly D. Right there. So then I start smoothing it back down with my hands and try to get shorter. I use a brush. Up, back, side, all over the place. Try it again. And now I'm pretty much given up and I'm going to use my hands to shape it. Um, and I just cut off about 17 minutes of it. Basically that the whole time. Um, but anyway, Cebu Short, do it the day right here. This is the end of it. It took a flat iron, it took some stickier ice, it took some combing, some bobby pins, some getting up and getting down to get to this point. Oh, and man, it was a journey. Um, I love this stuff. It works just as well as Jergens or any of those gradual tanning lotions on the market, but it smells so fresh and it doesn't leave you all weird and orange and like Lindsay Lohan on a bad day-ish between your hands, um, but you should wash your hands after you use it. And uh, basically it's by Cebu and it's lovely. And if you're going on any sort of beachy fun, fun in the sun vacation this winter, you need this. You want to try it first before it's available to buy because it's launching on Cyber Monday online. Um, message me, email me, jmap at cebuinternational.com, tweet me at cebu17, I'm tweeting again. Uh, it's like riding a bike, but it's kind of like a creaky bike that needs oil because I still really haven't found my voice, but I'm working on it. Or Facebook message us on the Cebu Facebook page, facebook.com slash cebuinternational. Um, Cebu loves you.